Jenna and Dale with Resort TV One and today we are at Disney Springs and we're going to do an informational video about Disney Springs. So we're going to tell you all about it and um, everything you need to know. So what is Disney Springs? You're going to find out right here in this video. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Okay, so we want to talk about what Disney Springs is. I know a lot of people um, have heard of it maybe haven't been here before not sure what's all involved so we are going to tell you all about disney springs and um, what you can expect when you come here so one thing about disney springs is it is absolutely free to get into disney springs including your parking so there are two garages here parking garages and they are both free to park um, and you do not need a ticket to get into Disney Springs. So it is completely free to come and walk around and hang out. So a lot of people will come to Disney Springs either um, first thing when they arrive and they only maybe have half a day or evening um, so they don't waste a ticket at Disney. They'll come here, hang out, go shopping. They might grab a bite to eat. Um, there's lots of fun things to do here and we are gonna show you all of that. Or sometimes on your last day of your trip before your plane takes off, before you need to be at the airport, you might come out and hang out at Disney Springs that day. So there are 60 restaurant options here at Disney Springs and there are 110 shopping options here. This is like a shopper's haven and a foodie's haven. So these little indicator things are um, green when there's nobody parked in this spot, but there is somebody there, so it's not green. And here are those little indicators telling you if there's any spots. This row has zero, and they have them all the way down the aisle there. And then here are the escalators and elevators. Um, and you have to go to level two to take the bridge over um, to get to Disney Springs. So this is the walkway over and then you have to go back down. So if you're on level one, you have to go up and then back down. out of the Lime Garage, like I said earlier. Beautiful view as you walk down. Nice fountain here. And this is part of the new area of Disney Springs. So here's a map, um, and right here is the Lime Garage where we park. Um, so there's World of Disney, uh, and then Ghirardelli and different things are over in that area. And then the orange garage is covered up, but it's right in this area over here. And it's easier to get to the theater and House of Blues, the Disney balloon. Uh, but yeah, here's a little overview of Disney Springs. It's pretty big. So here is BB Woof's. This is a little walk-up restaurant that they have here. And they have all sorts of different sausage, bratwurst options. Here's one fun thing that you can do here at Disney Springs. You can rent a car boat. Um, you can go for, I think a half an hour or an, uh, on one of these. That's super fun. So this is one of the more expensive restaurants here, Paddlefish. Um, and it's really good and if you go up on top of the um, Paddlefish there, you can get drinks and you have an amazing view. So this section is more of the older section of Disney Springs and it used to be called Downtown Disney. They renamed Downtown Disney to Disney Springs in 2015. 
and they completed the construction on the new area of Disney Springs in 2016. The World of Disney store over here is one of the largest Disney stores in the, in the world um, and it is newly remodeled. Over here is Rainforest Cafe, a really fun restaurant. Kids love this restaurant, really neat theming. And they even have a little lava lounge over here which has great views of the water. Here's a fun shop, Goofy's Candy Co. They have all sorts of yummy candy treats inside of here. Definitely stop and check this out while you're here. They even have a Christmas shop here all year long. Days of Christmas, this is one of my favorite shops. Smells like Christmas in here even, guys. to every store and every restaurant because that will make this video super long uh, but we'll try to go in a few they also have some splash zone areas for the kids throughout here's one of them right here next to the Christmas store and the art store so we are currently over in this area and if you want to take a boat ride and with your kids or maybe um, maybe even if you don't want to walk all the way over here um, there is a boat dock here that will take you over to the other side. It's a really fun, relaxing thing to do as well when it's um, hot in the afternoon. Wolfgang Puck Express over here is one of the um, cheaper, depending on what you order. They do have pizza, they do have some more expensive options as well, but um, and it's a little more quick than some others. You go up to the counter to order, um, then they bring you your food. But we do enjoy this one. They have really good pizza. And this is a kitchen shop. They have all the things that you'll need for your kitchen to give you amazing memories of your vacation here at Disney. All the Disney mugs that you would need. So they do have a carousel here. However, it is not free. It is $3 for one token, $5 for two. So I'm assuming one token per ride. One token per ride. There you go. Earl of Sandwich is one of our favorite restaurants here at Disney. Um, they have amazing paninis, soup, salads, um, and it is on the cheaper side as well. So we love coming here to Earl of Sandwich. A lot of times we'll even share a sandwich and get dessert somewhere too. And for those pin traders out there, here is the pin trading store. All the pins that you would need in here. They do decorate for different holidays and right now it is close to Halloween and so they have Halloween and fall decorations up. And here's another one of those splash pads that they have for the kids. This is a fun store, Once Upon a Toy. They have lots of Disney toys inside of here. Really cute theming. There's Woody up on top. I love all the details in here. Here's another fun thing for the kids, a train ride. Liam loves this, Josh's son. And this also costs, it is $3 for one token, five for two, and one per child, just like the carousel. And here is Trindy, 
for all the women in your life. This is a great spot for them. Lots of fun Disney and non-Disney clothes in here. The co-op store is a really neat uh, store. We'll definitely go inside of here there. So there are actually six different little stores in here. They have a tech store, a dog store, or sorry, pet store. Art store, a dress shop back here, a kitchen store, and over here is a men's store. They also have little booths inside of here, like uh, candles, different art things. Over here is a nice little area to hang out. They usually have live music. And you can get your drinks over here at Dockside Margarita. Ghirardelli's is an amazing chocolate and ice cream place. And it is also, I think the only thing, one of the few things, I guess, you get something free at Disney. The free chocolate that Dale's talking about is right over here. You go inside this shop and they hand out a yummy Ghirardelli chocolate. Dale's gonna go get one right now. See what kind they have. They mix them up sometimes. What's up? Is that good? Here's a closer view of the World of Disney store. Love Stitch up there. Yes? Alright. Watch out. Stitch spits. So here's what Dale got. He got a free regular size Ghirardelli Square and they're giving out the milk chocolate with caramel. Mm -mm -mm. So I do have a full video on this store. They just remodeled most of it so definitely go back on our channel and check that out and subscribe if you haven't because we do videos at Disney. Uh, new videos every day at 9 a.m. and we also live stream from a Disney park every Friday at 6 p.m. Eastern. things here at Disney Springs that they added is Starbucks and they even have two so this is a walk up outdoor one and we will show you the other one when we walk by it in the other section this stage they have either live performances at night or different school groups um, or different things like that will perform here during the day looks like they're having something going on today not sure what the Lego store has been here for a while. A fun place for you to come shopping for all your Legos. They also have um, Lego creations outside. Okay, so usually they have some uh, Lego creations here, but look, they are making uh, some new ones. That's fun, I like that. And this Lego creation has been here for a really long time. I hope they never take them away. This is the bridge that we took across over to Rainforest Cafe. Goofy's candy store over there. Just to give you a little perspective how big it is here. And the World of Disney store is right there. T-Rex is similar to the Rainforest Cafe, but with dinosaurs. We 
There's an Italian restaurant, Terralina. They just refurbed this one. There is a gluten-free bakery over here. Allergy friendly. And they also have a restaurant down here called The Boathouse. This one is an expensive restaurant, but very good. There's several stores throughout this area. Even more down this way. Joffrey's is another coffee shop here. This is a Disney-owned coffee place. They do live music here at night as well. And there's lots of little shops and different places to eat throughout this section. The hangar bar is a fun place to get a drink and sit outside and enjoy the view. One of the many things we enjoy to do is in the evening, come over here to this bar and we'll get a drink and just sit outside and uh, check out the view. And then also, you don't have to, uh, you can walk back there, very few people know this, there is a lot of old vintage boats back there that you can uh, walk around and take a look at as well. This is where you can get a boat either across over to where we were um, by Rainforest Cafe uh, you can also get it over to some of the hotels. So it's either um, Saratoga Springs or Old Key West from here. There's some shops in here. The Ganachery is a really good chocolate shop. Paradiso, they have some yummy food in this restaurant over here. A fun restaurant we've been there we did a review on it so check that video out and then there's Maria and Enzo's over here are these more of the pricey ones yeah these are a little more pricey and I would say this is probably the most expensive STK we have never been here heard it's excellent but yeah we'd like to try it sometime one fun thing they have is Enzo's hideaway tunnel bar and restaurant it looks like you're going nowhere. It's actually underneath where we're standing, um, and it's a really neat little bar, and I think they have some appetizers as well. <laughs> so this area over here is called the West Side. And right over here is the balloon. It's a lot of fun. It is $20 for adults, $15 for children. And here it goes right now. Dale and I actually went on this and we did a video on that so you can go back in our channel and search for it. It was a lot of fun, beautiful views up there. Here is the second Starbucks. This is one of my favorite spots because they have indoor seating. When it is super hot outside, go get your iced coffee and dessert and hang out in here. They're getting some free samples over here. Hopefully we will get one. We're gonna try, they're going quick. We got a strawberry green tea, it's pretty good. Not super sweet, but refreshing. This is a fairly new store, Disney style. Lots of fun ears different clothes to Disney bound in lots of cool outfits here's a Star Wars store now I do like to shop so you guys can go back into our channel search for my shopping videos I do a lot of store tours and merchandise checking out all the Disney merchandise so definitely go back and look for those videos over here is a fun place to hang out um, in the evenings they usually have live music they have some food trucks 
And it's a pretty view of the water as well. Across the way there, if you weren't sure that hotel, our resort is Saratoga Springs. Over there where the boats are, that's a spot where you can take a boat either to the different resorts or across back to the marketplace area. There's also the boat area right there where we were earlier. And behind the boat dock, uh, where the boat house is, where that little deck is, uh, there's another boat dock back over there where the marketplace is. Here comes the bloom. This is a really cool idea that they added uh, several years ago for some shade. It's perfect. More shops along this way. And over here is Bongo's, a big restaurant. It's more expensive, not, not as expensive as STK, but expensive. They even have an AMC theater with lots of theaters. I'm not quite sure how many they have, but on a hot afternoon or a rainy day, these are good options. Splitsville is a bowling alley and restaurant. They have really good food in here. And we're gonna go inside and give you guys a little peek. So it's like a retro bowling alley in here. You could either bowl or eat, or you can bowl and eat at the same time. So if you just wanna bowl, it'll set you up in a lane, or if you wanna eat, you also get a, a booth with your lane, so you can have some food as well. So right here used to be Disney Quest, but they are building a new MBA experience. We'll show you uh, some art over here in just a minute of concept art of what it's supposed to look like. The House of Blues is a great restaurant. I'd say it's decent prices, probably like an Applebee's, mm -hmm. uh, but better food, I yeah, would good think. Food. And they also do concerts here at the House of Blues. Um, so a lot of times people will come for those concerts. And as well, we'll just come out. They have a live band usually on the weekends. We'll just sit and enjoy the band and grab a drink. Yeah. Here's what it's supposed to look like. And it's opening summer 2019. This is Cirque du Soleil. They used to have a fun acrobatic show in here. Uh, it's been closed for a little while. I think they're coming up with a new show coming soon, but I'm not quite sure when. And this is one end of Disney Springs over here. Uh, again, this is the west side. There is also a um, parking lot over here, and it's not a parking garage, just a regular parking lot that you can park in as well. Just to give you a little uh, idea of where we're at, so we are right over in this area, there's Cirque du Soleil. And earlier we were over here by Rainforest Cafe, so we came all the way down here. So this side that we're at right now is considered the west side. Mostly shops and restaurants. A bowling alley and AMC uh, theater as well. Oh yeah. has a dine-in area that you can go watch your movie and 
eat some dinner as you're watching the movie. So this is where you enter for that. So this is the second garage that they have, the orange garage. As you can tell, it's closer to the west side. And I think it's a little bit bigger than the Lime Garage. Planet Hollywood is another really big restaurant that they have here and they just, well not just a year or so ago, they redid the inside of it and we still haven't been to check it out so we definitely need to do that. Another cool experience that they have here is the Coca-Cola store. As you can tell it's really, really big. They have all the Coca-Cola merchandise you would want. They also have a meet and greet with the Coca-Cola Bear. And then up on top there, they have a place where you can get your Coca-Cola drinks. They even have a um, flight with different Cokes from around the world. We're up on top of the Coca-Cola store and as you can tell, there is an amazing view up here. One of the newest restaurants here at Disney Springs is Chicken Guy. And this is one of our favorite spots as well. And I think this is probably one of the best priced restaurants in Disney Springs. <laughs> and it has something for both kids and adults. The chicken strips and the chicken sandwiches and everything chicken. So this area is called the Marketplace Building and usually you can see more of it. They are currently building another Wolfgang Puck's restaurant right here so that's what these walls are for. Coming soon it says. So this is really nice to go into when um, you're super hot because it is shaded in here and you get some of the AC from the different shops which is really nice as well. But as you can tell there are several different shops in here. So we got Tommy Bahama, Lucky over there. They even have Vera Bradley, Columbia. They even have a bar. into the newer part of Disney Springs. It looks like a really um, upscale mall. It's outdoor mall is what it looks like to me. Uh, but it still has a little Disney touch to it every once in a while. The Welcome Center is a place where you can buy tickets, you can buy special event tickets, uh, ask questions. If maybe something isn't working right on your ticket or your magic band, you can come and check those things out. So they're very helpful in here. Right past the Welcome Center is Deluxe Burger. And this is one of our favorite spots to get a burger. And it is um, reasonably priced. So I we would definitely recommend it. Here's Blaze Pizza. This is one of our favorite um, pizza places here. They have delicious pizza and um, it's kind of set up Subway style so you can add whatever toppings that you want and it's very reasonably priced and we like to share a pizza. Also in this area, um, it's a little more, like I was saying, upscale. The stores are a little more expensive. You have Coach, Kate Spade. Um, there's a diamond store super dry, different things like that in this area. So this is one of my favorite stores in this area, um, Ever After Jewelry & Co. So this is a Disney store, 
They have um, Disney bags and jewelry. They have um, lots of fun, different accessories in here. Uniqlo is a really neat store. You can find uh, cheaper Disney themed shirts and things in there, um, like I said, for a reasonable price. And over here is the Polite Pig, which is a barbecue place. And it is located right next to the Lime Garage, where you exit and go back to the Lime Garage. One more little section over here of shops. And over here, one of Dale's favorite stores oh, is trophy. It's called the Trophy Room. And um, it is actually Michael Jordan's son's store. His son, um, his name is Marcus. So that's that store over here. So here is Frontera Cocina. I've heard it's really good. We haven't tried it yet. I want to sometime. And then Pandora Jewelry is over here. Here it is. My, one of my favorite things here, Sprinkles Cupcakes. They are so good, guys. I definitely recommend it if you are here. They also have a cupcake ATM. So you can get your cupcake right here out of the ATM. You don't even have to go in the store. Morimoto is an Asian restaurant over here. They also have a sit down, another sit down restaurant over here called Homecoming. And it is delicious. We highly recommend that. So it is just over here on the left there. Raglan Road is a really yummy Irish restaurant. Very good. They even have some uh, performances and dancing in there sometimes. And Cooks of Dublin, which is right here, is it like a little fast food um, Irish place. They have fish and chips. Yummy, yummy. Amaretz is a pastry shop here and they have amazing stuff inside. And the shops continue as we go down. Levi's, there's a Harley store. Alright guys, well that is it from Disney Springs. I hope you enjoyed coming along and checking it out with us. I hope it was informative and um, helped you decide if you wanted to come and what places maybe you wanted to check out while you were here. So yeah, yeah. we really enjoy coming here. Yeah, we do. Mm -hmm. So definitely um, give us a thumbs up if you like the video, leave us a comment, let us know if you've been here before and what your favorite thing is here. Subscribe if you haven't. Definitely. And check out our sponsors, mickeyblog.com and mickeytravels.com for the best in free Disney planning advice. And also windowrepairparts.us and use the coupon code RESORTTV1 for 20% off your purchase. And MainStreetDVCresale.com. See how easy it is to sell your DVC commission free. So for now, have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye bye. Now that you've finished watching this video, be sure that you're subscribed so that you can get all of the latest updates. Also, check out some other great videos on our channel. Have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye bye. <laughs>